Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In search of lighter, faster OS, probably for low-end hardware, it's a bit difficult to choose a minimal usage OS. When a number of lightweight distro available, which one is faster, lighter, stable is not easy to judge. In our video, we will explore some lightweight OS distribution and perform CPU benchmark, which results in the form of core score. Higher score probably means higher performance in our case. Ultimately, we can find a lightweight, faster OS. So let's check out. MX Linux is a mid lightweight distro based on Debian using Antix component with some additional package added by MX community. It was developed to make desktop efficient with higher stability and performance. This distro uses XFC as well as KDE environment, its latest version MX19.1 which can handle UFI computer as well. Solus OS is an independent operating system based on Linux kernel which uses own desktop environment. It releases distro under the slogan install today, upgrade forever. It has wide variety of desktop environment which includes own budget desktop as well as made genome and KD plasma. It offers point release as well as rolling updates. It features included curated release in a sense that once installed, end users are guaranteed to continuously receive security updates. In Solus OS, no need to worry about software breakage during upgrades and end of life. It is one of the best Linux distro in 2017 according to Puppy Linux belongs to the family of lightweight distribution that focus on ease of use and minimal memory usage. This OS can run entire on random SS memory which can only take around 200 MB. It also allows USB bootable to be removed after OS started. It is complete OS as well as can be used as a rescue disk. Latest version of Puppy Linux built from Ubuntu 18.04 packages. It accepts number of packages such as Debian, RPM and its default format PET. This distribution originally developed by Barry Collar. Lubuntu is also another lightweight Linux distribution which uses LXQT environment in place of Genome. It was initially aimed to develop a lighter, less resource and energy efficient OS, but now it is more a modular distribution. Lubuntu original uses LXD desktop, but now it uses LXQT desktop, which is a merger of LXD and Razer QT projects. It is basically one of the flavor of Ubuntu. LXLE Distro, also based on Debian, it uses LXD environment. It is a lightweight and fast distro which focus on visual aesthetic. It works on both new and old computer configuration. LXC means LXD -E with luxury edition which focus on minimal resources. It contains useful modification and checks which can enhance performance. Antix Linux developed directly from Debian Stable. It is also one of the distribution from lightweight category and suitable for older computer. It also provides cutting edge kernel application as well as updates via apt get. It comes with three versions with minimum requirement of 128 MB RAM and 1 GB of hard drive. Its default desktop environment is XFCE and its latest version is Marile Franco.
Bodhi Linux is an another lightweight distribution that uses Moksha Window Manager. It provides minimal base system and it contains only essential software such as browser and file manager. This distro also based on Ubuntu required only minimum of 256 MB of RAM and 500 MHz processor. Sparky Linux is one of the ultra lightweight distro, more efficient and less eating resource for low hardware PCs. It takes only 90 MB of RAM to low end PC desktop with 5% CP usage. It offers great performance and stability. This project was born as Ubuntu Remix Enlightenment as default desktop. After a few months, it was renamed to Sparky Linux. Linux Light Distro, also known as Gateway Operating System, as it was created to make transition from Windows to Linux. This distribution offers lightweight desktop experience based on XFC. It offers light application for novice Linux user. It is based on Debian Ubuntu. Linux Light developed by Jerry Bison. Finally, we have combined all our results from 9 lightweight distribution by performing CPU benchmark. As you can see, Linux Lite have high score from all other distributions while MX Linux have lowest score. Some distribution more or less same and the difference between highest to lowest in case of multi-core is around 900, which is much larger difference cannot be neglected. So, we conclude that Linux Lite is a really ultra lightweight OS among various Linux distribution. At last, according to my opinion, as if you want to choose a lightweight distro which have performance, go for Linux Lite. Hope you like my video. Please share and subscribe unlock tweaks even your videos and unsubscribe support us. Thanks for watching.